my name's Lori, and uh, my name is uh, Yanakti Yasta. And um, my mom was Haudenosaunee, and my dad was uh, was an Englishman. And um, I learned so much from my mom, and I learned so much from the elders. And it wasn't something I really saw till I was in my late twenties. And I've learned, you know, I, I've known my friend for a long time, Gail. And I always honored her, her children, her motherhood. And I always have tried to be a supporter of that. Um, you know, everything I've heard about the water, you know, it, it's our first gift from the Creator. And if we don't take care of that, like everyone has said here, you know, um, we all, whether we're Christian and, um, you know, God made us stewards of the earth. And, um, you know, the, 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 the Haudenosaunee are people of the land. And if they need to show us how, you know, to take care of things and let it be so, you know, um, they're a minority group. And you know, a peaceful people, you know, like, they're not resulting to violence, you know, they're not letting their anger get the best of them, um, they're not being discriminative, you know, they're trying to say, let us be heard, something be done, you know, um, it's, it's a sad day when um, any woman, any woman, needs to take away her own basic rights, her own basic needs of life to be heard, to be, to be captured. And, um, you know, so many people that I know, Haudenosaunee, are educated people. You know, we think, oh, you know, old stereotypes, the, the drunken Indians and all this stuff, you know. And, um, but you know, those treaties were made to be honored. If we don't have our word, what do we have? You know, and those things were, were meant to be honored. And, um, you know, we, so much of what I've heard in the little time I've, I've been able to hear, you know, is honoring the spirit. Everybody, you know, it's about spirit, spirit that grow, that's inside us spirit that's outside of us, you know, um, and the, sp the spirit within, we all need that. We all need that. And I hear a lot of it's, it, anger and hurt and, you know, um, I'm sorry, I don't know your name, but you mentioned about, you know, here's the problem. How do we work on the solution? And it, it's like, you know, it's like being stuck, and I don't understand how come the government cannot make personal, you know, I, I don't know if it was John or who, but what somebody said, how come we can't, um, how come the government doesn't help us? You know, it doesn't always need to be finances and food. It could be, you know, just gifts from the heart, from the mouth to say, you know, people be kind to each other. There, there are, you know, yeah, there may be more of us, but that doesn't make more right, you know, bring people together and, um, you know, help your fellow man, because no matter what, you know, um, we have red blood going through all of us. We are all here, and we are only as strong as our weakest link. And if we're not helping, you know, if, if we're not helping each other, you know, that's one of the great commandments is, is to help others as you would like to be helped. So, um, you know, I, I just feel like we've become such a community or people of, um, of, um, of, of, self and um, we need to get back to basics you know like thank you thank you